lucky to have bees at the hotel, looking over peach tree for quite some years, and started off by an adoption. The truck was coming through the city and was in an accident and these bees needed somewhere to live. The hotel was contacted by the Atlanta Beekeeping Association. We started with one hive and now we're up to eight. James, our pastry chef, has taken care of them bees since day one. When I was very young, we actually had beehives at my parents' house in New Jersey. My brother had them. I helped and, and got into the hives with them. Now it's completely different. Now I'm responsible. I, I'm fascinated every single day by the amount of information that I learn just going into the hives. So she's pulling out a bee that's dying. I mean, I've watched queen bees hatch. I get to look at the queens and just watch their activity every day. I get to see what the other bees do. And it's just all amazing. It's not always about keeping honey or getting honey. It's about keeping something alive for them to produce that honey. And that's what just makes it all fascinating. He loves it. He has a huge passion about the honey and the bees. He loves spending time up there, ensuring that the bees are producing honey and that we're able to utilize that in our hotel and give it back to our customers. For Hyatt, our food philosophy is thoughtfully sourced, carefully served, and that focuses on three pillars, healthy planet, healthy people, and healthy community. And so everything we do when it comes to food and beverage at the hotel, we focus on them pillars to ensure that we're following the right way on what we're producing, what we're putting out, and what our customers are eating. When you are at the top of the hotel in Polaris looking over the city, it's such a green environment. There's trees and pollen everywhere. The bees will go as far as botanical gardens, the Carter Museum, they'll go to Georgia Tech, as well as the small garden we have on our rooftop. It just really brings that philosophy of the healthy planet, ensuring that we're giving back to the planet, we're being more sustainable. We're doing our part by introducing them back into the environment here in Atlanta. We're close to a million bees in the height of the summer. 200 feet over my shoulder is about as local and as sustainable as you can get. Between herbs from the garden and you know grabbing honeycomb and bringing up to Polaris and putting it onto somebody's plate literally in the same day, I mean, could be within the same couple hours, it really truly does fit in with how our thought process about food works. And being able to share that with our guests just gives a great deal of satisfaction at the end of the day that we know we did something that not a lot of places actually can do or will do. The honey caramel is to die for. It's really strong today. That honey, you get that very floral today.